We are using energy at the rate of 2.4 kilowatts per person. 2,400 watts. This is, we're using energy at the same rate as 24 old-fashioned 100 watt, watt light bulbs burning day in, day night uh, out for every man, woman, and child on the planet. So it's a lot of energy. According to the International Energy Agency in Paris, world energy use is expected to grow 50% by 2030. Is, does it need to grow? Certainly not for us, but those of us from developed countries, I'm quite sure we could maintain our current lifestyle with quite a lot less energy. But it is needed to lift billions of people out of poverty in the developing world. 80% uh, of our energy is generated by burning fossil fuels, oil, coal, gas. I'll tell you where the other 20% comes from later. This has two problems. It's causing climate change, and a lot of pollution. And secondly, they are not going to be there forever. So let's, we've got to find 80%, in fact more, because it's growing, if it's going to go on growing, and we don't know where it's coming from. So we're going to need more efficient energy use, probably a change of lifestyle, a major and expanded sources of clean energy, which is going to require financial measures to make people change their behavior, and new technology. In fact, the political challenge, financial challenge, may be even bigger than the technical challenge. The politicians are beginning to say the right things. They're not actually doing the right thing, but they are beginning to say it. And the young people understand this, and they are beginning to put pressure. So you have to have two ideas in your mind. It's almost impossible, but we cannot fail. So you've got to be optimistic, and you've got to be, keep working on it. And in all this, what you guys are doing is vitally important. Thank you very much.